started putting everybody's gifts on the bed. Um, we've got some Soho Skin, which is honestly the most gorgeous discovery set for skin, and it's all travel size. Some La Roche Posay SPF, a slip silk eye mask, and an FP Movement cap. So hopefully that's a lovely surprise for everyone. Guys, we're at Arafana Beach. We've got group two here. They're all amazing. All girls this week, nine of us, nine girls. Um, we're just, they're just doing all the warm up on the beach. I've just been for a week. And um, I've got, I've got trapped nerve in my back. So I am just gonna be providing cheerleading support, not actually surfing myself today at least. Um, and then yeah, just want everyone to get settled, feel supported and be in the water. and. Everyone's really excited and nervous, so yeah, I'm just gonna go over there now and be with them. Um, but yeah, not much to report really apart from that, I did sleep with my back, but do you know what, I don't care. I'm in Portugal running Marnie Rose with loads of amazing people, so it could be worse, couldn't it? <laughs> a beautiful day. can't remember the last time where I got up to whether when I was speaking to you. It's just so busy. The days are so busy. I've shot, I've probably got so much in my teeth. I've shot a full campaign for free people today. We've been surfing. I was in the water today. I think I said to you, I was in the water cheerleading today and giving people pushes, some, some people pushes off the board. <laughs> I was a bit vigorous. <laughs> but um, we had so much fun. We've had the sun all day. It's been so beautiful. Everyone's so chilled. We've had a gorgeous yoga session. It's just been, an, honestly, 10 out of 10 day. Apart from the nerve pain in my bum and my leg. <laughs> but I didn't surf today on purpose for that. It's not... Yeah, it's just an issue, but I'm trying to ignore it and just crack on. Um, tomorrow I do need to surf because I need to film some surfing. Sorry, I'll have olives in my teeth. I need to film some surfing tomorrow, um, which is going to be pressure and exciting. So I will do that. Um, one pizza night tonight. <clears throat> pizza oven's gone kaput <laughs> so we've got like um uh what have we got a pizza tile and like an open wood oven thing so we're same similar vibe but the pizza oven yeah we were it was it was a gas situation <laughs> it's me and gas we turned the gas on it was fine last week amazing and then we turned the gas on for this week and all we could smell was gas and we we're like mm, no turn that off right now <laughs> so yep dealt with that Everyone's having the pizza bit by bit. Everyone's got a glass of wine. I'm just walking down to look at the sunset because it's going to be... Tap that. It's really dusky and beautiful. And we've barely had any sunset as well. I've been here. It's my second sunset the whole time. Um, so yeah, it's just been a beautiful day. I hope you're all okay. I hope you've enjoyed Marnie's week one vlog. I, I get lost in track of time of what I'm saying to you and what I'm not because it's just such a busy time. But I hope it's enough. And like, yeah, tell me what you want to know as well. Like, there's so much business stuff happening behind the scenes that I always want to share with you, but I never know where to start. So always ask. Maybe I'll try and like find some order in it all. I found four guests here. Guys! <laughs> We're doing uh, Sunset Tag Team. Oh, okay. I'm going to look at... Just about to do... yeah, Is it? Oh God, oh God. <laughs> 
guys, I think this is like one of my favorite places here at this villa because there's a little bench here. Oh my God. And then this one's that happens right in between these hills. I think I showed you this last year, maybe. Oh my God. I'm just gonna sit here for a sec because it is so beautiful. Guys, sweet mother of God, it's boiling in here. Hang on. Woo! Oh, I hope you're all so well. I've just had 10 minutes to myself to do toilet roll run, a lip balm run. I just uh, went to the pharmacy. Uh, Portuguese pharmacies have amazing beauty products. I just got this new, I, I always want to say it's Nukes. It's the honey um, repair balm for damaged lips. And when I say damaged, I mean damaged because of surfing it, they get really cracked and dry and burnt oh that feels absolutely gorgeous and my water intake has been abysmal so I've just bought a massive water so I'm gonna use plastic I know I'm sorry but I needed it desperately um yeah and I've just been like pootling around the little town getting bits and bobs for people that they need in the house um because as much as I love running Marnie Rays you actually don't ever get a second alone like I'm never ever alone um so yeah i think i said this last week uh so yeah i was like do you know what i'm gonna go for a little drive call my dad call my mom they were sat next to each other <laughs> but yeah it was really nice it's been nice just to get out for like 10 15 minutes and i'm gonna head back up to the villa now everyone's doing yoga and then we've got like a really gorgeous like picnic style dinner tonight same same setup as last week and then we're going to go to the cliff because we've had beautiful beautiful weather the sunset's going to be amazing and i can't wait for everyone to see it and i can't wait to see the sunset up there either because it's not been good this, the last week was like absolutely shit weather so yeah i can't wait for that mm. Mm. what else i spent most of the day running around having, having to shoot today uh, for work, which is fine. Um, it just is quite full on when I'm trying to be fu like fully full-time working at Marnie Rays as well for people. But it was fine because everyone surfed. I went and cheerlead, did, did a bit of cheerleading, came away, did the shoot, and then we all went for lunch together. So I, actually, it's fine. It feels like longer hours away for me, but for them, they're just like buzzing. They're all standing up, they're all surfing. They're just like, heaven it's so good this group this week is just oh my god i mean i say this every week but they're just so gorgeous we've got nine women and they're all like thick as thieves like proper fast mates and it's so nice and i they don't need me i love talking to them but i'm just like i'll just let you guys be create connections have your time so yeah it's really quite a privilege to watch friendships and connections like build so yeah. What else do I have to tell you? Tomorrow is Marnie Ray's night out. So we've got um, a really beautiful restaurant that we're going to. Different one to last week. Uh, so that'll be great. We've got surfing. And we've just got this little routine down where we surf. We all grab gorgeous coffees or like homemade lemonades. We have like a bit of a stand around and a chat and take some pictures of the beach and like chill and then we head back and have this lovely free day until yoga and it's just honestly I wouldn't want to introduce like more and more and more activities I think two like one at the beginning and one at the end so everyone has free time to just be and take what they want from their trip in the middle is so perfect everyone wants to lay get a tan read a book journal like everyone's really independent and self-sufficient in like yep yeah, I need to take this for my my own self was really nice to see so yeah and i've had some beautiful conversations with lots of the girls and it's yeah just the best like i feel very lucky that this is my job even if i do need 10 minutes on my own to go and get some toilet roll <laughs> just rang daddy's like where are you going i was like toilet roll run he was like bleed now i was like yeah he was like have you not got have you not got people to help you with all this stuff shouldn't you be at the villa i was like yeah but i want to do this mm. so yeah we're good. Everything's good over here. God, this is good. Really nice. I need to go and wash my hair, to be quite honest. <laughs> Two days I've not washed it for. But what is the point? I'm in the sea every day. 
my back pain and bum pain, the sciatic thing that I've got going on, it's calmed right down. And I did surf today for a little bit because I needed to shoot some stuff. But, whilst I was surfing, but yeah, I'm gonna surf properly tomorrow. Hopefully the waves are bigger. They were baby waves today and it's so lovely and fun, but they just didn't come as often as I wanted them to. So I just sat there for ages waiting. But it's all joy, whatever it is. Right, I'm going now. I'm gonna go. Ow, I'm gonna go and have a, I'm gonna go and stretch and then have a shower. I'm gonna go to six. I think we're eating at seven, so that gives me some time now. Yeah. Right, I'm going. Um Thank you so much for watching. Hope last week was all right. I, I know that this week's probably gonna be similar and I can't remember what I've said, done, vlogged about. So yeah, hope it's okay. Normal programming will resume obviously when I get home, but I hope you enjoy seeing all of this. Do you know what's really gorgeous as well is that like lots of viewers book this retreat and I didn't know that. And so I, like I said to you the other day, I should ask and I did. And I'm like, oh, hi, okay, hi from YouTube. Um, and whilst I've been here, cause we've been sharing loads of content behind the scenes, um, Cornwall's fully booked, which is great. Bali's had some more booking, which is amazing. But it's nearly full Bali, but obviously it's a long way, so I understand it's not going to be like out the door. Um, but yeah, like I think people seeing what goes on here and how much joy there is here, like makes people want to come, which is obviously my favourite thing. I'm just like, yes, it is so good because it's so hard because I only run them in the summer. I'm like all year I have to edge my content out to be like, guys, please come, it's amazing. Um, but yeah, that makes me so happy, honestly. Like get to do it all again all the time just class right i'm going <sighs> thanks for listening <laughs> gorgeous <laughs> lost my jumper <laughs> guys we're at the cliff and it is beautiful look at that sunset hi ellie oh, sorry. ellie is an incredible photographer editor all-round big babe and she's been on this retreat with us supporting us with all the content and honestly i don't know how i'm gonna let her go but she's got to go traveling don't you mate i'm gonna go back to, back to bangkok but she's gonna be in bali with us aren't you <sighs> Manny Ray's bali. yeah boy so excited it's gonna be so good it's gonna be so good look at these look at these people Gorgeous. So beautiful. Oh, dogs here as well. Fresh dog. Good Manny. How's Manny here? Oh. Hi guys. From departure day at Marnie Ray's, it was really busy gorgeous last couple of days at Marnie's but I haven't vlogged it because I just honestly haven't been present for a single second of it and I just wanted to put my phone down and we've been making so much behind the scenes content and like trying to do a great job of that so that we can market it beautifully so people know exactly what they get when they come and spend time with us and yeah I just was like realizing that I actually wasn't in the moment and I was like do you know what tools down phone down laptop down no work I'm just gonna work at Marnie's and like be with the guests be with my team and it's been really beautiful um I'm really emotional today obviously um as I always am but I yeah it's mental we all had a big goodbye this morning all my team and our lovely last guests left this morning as well and I've just driven myself back to the airport in this nine-seater alone to decompress and yeah like what a beautiful special couple of weeks I feel so lucky that this is my job. I mean, I cry so much, I know this, but I'm so lucky that this is my job. And I've met so many beautiful, beautiful people this last couple of weeks. Um, and the resounding feedback is it's absolutely surpassed everyone's expectations. They thought it would be good, but not this good. And I'm like, oh. every time someone says something nice to me, I cried. <laughs> so anyway, lifelong friendships have been made. All the girls are meeting up. Like I'm seeing some of the girls in LA, we've got, all of the girls in London who are gonna hang out and make friends and meet up and like three girls from LA came and they're now friends two of them came together but one of them came alone and now they're pals and they're gonna meet up there and it's just like sitting stepping back and watching that happen is obviously the most beautiful thing so I'm gonna give this mini bus back <laughs> goodbye nine seater um and I'm gonna go in the airport I'm pretty early but I tried to change my flight too but 
I've just watched half the team take off literally on the plane, like as I drove up to the airport, because I couldn't get on the earlier one, but never mind. Nice time to decompress. Gonna go sit and get a big glass of Coke and yeah, but I was just about to say, I love you loads, because Lizzie popped up and we always sign off saying, I love you loads, <laughs> but I do love you loads. And thank you so much for watching. Um, this so far i'll probably vlog again tomorrow when i get back to london but who knows i feel all over the show but in a very nice way i just yeah i need to probably unpack and decompress a bit but yeah thank you guys and i will catch up with you soon well i am back from marnie's and before i go any further i just want to address what is on my nose i got bit by a mosquito and it turned into an infection so you should have seen it it's worse like this is it this is its healing um anyway it's all good i was like how has this happened right at the end of my nose but anyway i've got antibiotics and it's all fine i'm just trying to be like a little house hermit for a bit <laughs> um but i'm home like trying to decompress from the most amazing couple of weeks of Marnie Ray's like it's so weird to be by myself I feel really strange being alone um but it has been honestly just the most special time like yeah like considering it started off with a bit of frustration let's say and I was like a bit sad because I was wanting it to be perfect nobody noticed nobody knew it, I didn't need to get upset. It was fine. We sorted it out. We made it perfect. So, yeah. Um, considering that was the way it started out, it just went from strength to strength. And this, there were so many amazing, like, friendships and connections formed. And, like, everyone was emotional because it surpassed people's expectations. And that's the feedback that I got. And then it made me cry because I was like, oh, my God. And there's something just really special in holding space for people, like, and for them to come and be who they are. And... Yeah, God, it like just brings me the most joy. I've had, on, it's just been amazing. And obviously it's hard work and obviously I'm working the whole time, but the joy surpasses any kind of like tiredness that comes with that. Like it's just, it's just so worth it. Like, and it's a job. So of course you have to work, you have to work hard. Um, but yeah, it was just incredible. And I am just about to log on and launch Costa Rica for 2025. I've just got to do some things at the back end and then by the end of this week it will be live so yeah I can't wait and lots of people from this one were excited about Costa Rica and maybe want to come to that so I'm like oh my god it's going to be some kind of reunion and it's going to be amazing um so yeah just really happy to be home and just so I haven't had a minute to sit and think whether I'm proud of myself or not and it just makes me emotional when I do think like that and I've had lots of messages from people saying I hope you're giving yourself time to like decompress and be proud of yourself you created something so beautiful and I'm like yeah but when you're doing something we don't <laughs> I spoke about this before like you don't stop and reflect enough to be proud of yourself or be like really happy for yourself um so yeah like I probably need to work on that I've been journaling loads to try and get it out there I'm so distracted by this so I can't imagine how distracted you are I didn't even bother to cover it up. I've got some cream on it. Anyway, um, yeah. So what my plans are, I've like, I've been a bit underground. I haven't really done anything, gone anywhere. I've been back a couple of days now. Um, I've just been doing my washing, which is taking forever. I've just got my, another pile there. Um, and yeah, I'm just taking it really easy. Um, I've also spent the first day that I got back like in and out of scans and all kinds of things probably just overreacting just because I hurt my back and I was like I need to know what it is the physio in me is like I want to know what it is so I can treat it um it's like a sciatica type -y thing but I think it's from surfing which is totally fine <laughs> but I'm like I'm in the walls as my mum and dad would say um but it's, it, like it is all fine I just yeah I just wanted to know what it was so that I can treat it properly and look after myself because I'm going to go on a little solo road trip to Cornwall um and go surfing in a couple of weeks for a couple of weeks so I just want to be good for that because I want to just spend some time surfing from beach to beach basically um what else I think that's about it I I'm not doing anything today I'm not going anywhere tonight I'm just gonna have a bath and catch up with like 
Vampire Diaries and cook myself something. But in the meantime, I'm going to be launching Costa Rica, making sure that's all good to go. Portugal's also going to launch. Cornwall's also going to launch for next year. Like, it's all going on. And it feels really, like, surreal. <laughs> um, but, yeah, honestly, guys, thank you so much for watching and for being on this journey with me. It's been a really beautiful experience and just, I feel very lucky. Like, I feel very, very lucky that I get to do this for a job. And the sun's shining in London, so it's not been too bad at all. Um, hopefully, the next time I see you, this nose will have settled down, but who knows? <laughs> um, so, yeah, sending all my love to you all. I hope you're all good. Ooh, it's a loud plane. Um, but, yeah, I'll catch up with you later if anything crops up. But, yeah, for, in the meantime, just ignore my nose and I'll ignore it too. <laughs> good morning, everybody, from a glorious day in London. I have been, oops, I have been the worst vlogger of all time. I just, it took me so long to come back down to earth after morning rays. I just think I get the blues when I leave. I'm like, oh, it's over, like, and I, I don't know, it just takes me, it, it's taken me a week to um, feel like settled again at home. Cause I just, I just miss it so much. Like I miss the surf, I miss the guests, I miss running around and all being together. And then you just come home and I'm like, oh, nobody's here um but yeah it's a really lovely problem to have obviously and so yeah so I've been really crap on the uh, vlog uptake I went home up north as well for the weekend see family and friends and it was gorgeous did Thursday to Sunday um and it was just so nice and come back to London it's beautiful weather so I'm very very happy I'm just sat here now about to have a meeting to book in two Marnie Ray's retreats for next year, which I'm really excited about and I can't wait to announce. Um, also, you'll see that there is a huge giveaway happening on Marnie Ray's Instagram. We're giving away a place for you and a friend to come to our Bali retreat. So you have to just um, like the post, tag your friend and follow us and then you will be in with a chance to win that. So I'm going to get this vlog up quick <laughs> so that you have time to go and like enter and everything. But yeah. I was like, I really want to just, yeah, do something nice and invite some people. And it's my biggest retreat, so I've got more rooms than ever. So it's it's good to have the, the space to play with to like offer a giveaway like that, which is really exciting. Um, my nose is cleared up. It's just like a bit pink now, thank God. I was honestly falling apart when I got back. I was like, what is going on? Um, but we all said that all the staff were like, oh, we've all got the Marnie Ray's blues because nobody wanted to come home or leave. And like everyone was like, oh, I'm a bit sad. <laughs> But again, lovely problem to have. Um, so yeah, I'm just pottering today. Like I say, I've got these really exciting, important meetings happening. And then I'm actually hosting a gorgeous dinner party at my house, in my home, tomorrow with Near Travel um, to launch their um, the start of summer, really, and the start of travel for everybody. So I've got 10 beautiful people coming around to my house. I've got an amazing chef. I've curated it all myself. I don't know who I am. Well, actually, I do now because I can run a retreat so I can curate a dinner. I just can't do the cooking. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to just get the house ready. Yes, yeah, so I've only got this small table. So we've got a big one fit for 10 people and some extra chairs come in. Um, and I just need to clean and just make it all nice and things. So I'm excited. So, yeah, day at home of like pottering and getting things done. But, yeah, I fell off the wagon with the vlogs um, just because I didn't know my ass from my elbow. So now I do. I'm back in the room. It's fine. Uh, so, yeah, the vlog's going to be late again and then... We'll be back on track, I promise. But I've got like I've got the just the most lovely time happening between now and the whole summer. I honestly just feel very lucky. Um, I'm gonna go off to Cornwall on my own for a week. I've got I seem to have made lots of friends in Cornwall in the surf community, so I'm gonna go and see everybody. I'm gonna go and surf. I'm having a board made down there. Oh, I just feel very lucky. It's very nice. Um, I'm going to Italy for a night for work, which will be so fun. And yeah, so good that I'm just very happy and very lucky all at once. So yeah, this is just a very quick catch up from me and I will speak to you um, again later and show you any goings on. I actually do want to show you what I'm wearing because I just live in it. I've been living in my FP movement stuff, generally anyway, but more so since Marnie's because I'm just like, I ordered stuff that I reach for every single day. And I just am obsessed. Let me show you. Okay, so we've got a free people vest, which is just so good. Like the, the curved curved hems and they just look so nice. And I really like that they cover these bits that I always hate. 
and it's kind of like double lined around here and here and I have one in uh, cream, one in black and I love them. And then my shorts are FP movement and they're just so good. I wore the white pair every single day in at Marnie Race nearly, I had to put them in the wash about four times. Um, but I've got the green as well and they came just after I left and I was gutted. So I'm just like, yes, this, this, this for summer, just like chucking on, but also with socks, trainers, go for a walk, doing whatever. I just feel so comfortable and so myself. So I'll put some links on for them, but yeah, they're the best. Like these come in so many colors, these come in so many colors. I literally can't rave enough. Hi guys. I've just had a little delivery um, of stuff that I bought in the net porter sale. Um, I wasn't supposed to be buying anything, but here we are. So I got um, a couple of pieces from Dresden Van Noten and a pair of shorts from Lulu Studio. So I'm going to show them all to you and then we're going to try them on. Um, so the sandals were in the sale and I just wanted some nice, I just wanted some new like cool sandals. I think they're so cool. Look at them. They're like really squishy ropey. They're, um, they've got like a metallic thread through them and I just think they're really cool. So I'm gonna try them on in a minute. They look so soft and I just think they're so nice. Denim from Dress Van Noten is honestly like some of my favorite. I've got this amazing pair. You will have seen them in like cream with like loads of like pencil drawings all over and they're so long and wide and high-waisted and they're just perfect. So I've got some dark ones and they've got like orange whip stitching on them and they've got little pockets on, but they they look so long and nice and high-waisted. And yeah, look at those, look at the stitch. Just to keep in theme with my jorts season, I live in my Carhartt ones every single day and they're like, I just need another color. So I bought some in white, um, but they're from Lulu Studio and I got them on net as well. But they just seem lovely and soft. So I'm just going to try them all on for you now and let's see. Let's keep all, keep all sent back. Okay, these are the Lulu Studio shorts. I got them in a size 27. Oh, I like those. They fit pretty well. They hit just like on the knee. I like those a lot and they're really soft. They're not like super rigid denim. They're good, aren't they? Yeah, I like those. I'll keep those. Guys, I'm not the biggest fan of these. They're really comfy and Ugh, I just don't think I like them enough. I'm gonna send them back. Not a fan. Guys, something ridiculous has happened. <laughs> right, let me just show you this. So there's a button, all the buttonholes. There's not a single button here. There is nowhere for those buttons to close. So that just hangs open. Are they joking? Is that why they're in the sale? They fit beautifully. I love them. They're great. And they're really long. Let me show you. Like, yeah, they're great. So long, so lovely, they fit beautifully. And then, is that, that's not right, is it? <sighs> right, about that goes. Good morning, everybody, from Tuesday. Um, I hope that you're all so well and that you're having glorious weather wherever you are. Like, look at this, heaven. What the heck is going on? <laughs> so exciting that it's so warm all the time. Um, I am having a full day of getting ready for this party this evening, dinner party. We've got the table, the chairs have come. I'm waiting for the flowers now. I've just got to get it all sorted. I've got some candles here ready to go. Yeah all systems go and I've got to go out and do a shoot now um, for a couple of hours in the middle of it so it's going to be a full-on day but a very very fun one I'm excited and Kim gets here later as well so I can't wait to see her but I'm going to sign my vlog off now and um, I'll show you the dinner party and everything for next week but thank you so much for watching it's been a bit of a higgledy piggledy one from Portugal Marnie Rays to London so yeah I hope it's okay and I hope you've enjoyed it and yeah I hope that you're all very very well and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week <laughs>